What's going on, people? It's a flying modem, the casual gamer who loves to play competitively. And today we got a Kim Strike fail for you and call it Ghost. And this is going to be something I do on my channel where I put up the Kim Strike fail. I'm going to have a counter. And in the comments below, I want everybody who watches this to put in the comments below what you guess my streak was. Like, did I go on there? 17 or 16? You know, what was my streak? So, in the comments below, just let me know your guess. And at the end of the video, you get to see if you were right or how close you were to being right and things like that. So, right now, I'm just showing you a quick uh, little streak I went on that I got taken off of. I was, I was kind of upset about that. And then I go on the Kim Strike Fell streak. Which, I guess this was kind of like a Kim Strike Fell streak. But, you know, it just wasn't high up there. So, I wasn't, like, really sweating that. But... Again, that's not the topic of today. That's enough about the gameplay. We're going to talk about how to grow a YouTube channel. Now, most YouTube channels, the at least successful YouTube channels, they don't have, they don't make one channel and then it's just super successful. They make a few channels before, like one or two channels before. And then in my case, this is my third channel. My first channel was focused on funny skits and things like that. My second channel was a gaming channel. And now I have this channel, a flying modem. And uh, my first gaming channel was centered around my gamer tag. And now this one is the same thing. I'm a flying modem. My channel is a flying modem. You know, that's my alias for Xbox Live and things like that. So, again, the question is, how do, do you grow a YouTube channel? Well, there's a lot of things people tell you, you know, they tell you, you need to do this, you need to have the best equipment, you need to have the best mic, the best recording audio, the best this, the best laptop, you need to play the best games, you need to do this, and they, all, they give you these generic things and what to do and stuff like that, and it's not very helpful, you know, even after you spend... Let's say, let's say, let's say, let's say YouTube isn't cheap. Let's say you spend two thousand dollars on equipment and all this stuff, and now you're ready to get into YouTube. Well, that doesn't guarantee that you're gonna be successful on YouTube. You know, it, it just doesn't, and it sucks. You know, but you know that's what people tell you to do. They tell you, oh, you gotta spend this X amount of money to be anywhere near my level of success and stuff like that, and that sucks. You know, it's discouraging people, and you know people don't want to shell out money like that for something that's not a guarantee like you're going to be the biggest thing ever on YouTube and I understand that you know so my first gaming channel I try to do everything half ass and you know try to give things I try to do things in a half ass manner basically and you know it worked out kind of but you know I, you, I wasn't putting out content that people consistently or a large amount of people wanted to watch so, I, you know, my channel didn't grow as big or as much as I wanted to. So, I had, in the end, you know, I had a, to take a step back and reassess the situation. And now I know from my first experience of my gaming channel what to do and what not to do. You know, my first channel, I didn't have a dedicated mic like I do now. I didn't have... A way of editing videos and stuff like that. My gameplays weren't the best. My commentaries weren't the best. And I'm not saying they're the best right now. But now I'm coming into it with a more with more knowledge of what to do and how to do it. And from moving forward, I expect for my channel to grow a large amount in comparison to my last channel. Now... I can't stress enough that some things just aren't going to happen or as fast as sometimes you want. So the the best way to grow a channel is to go forth with what you know you're going to do, test the waters, and come back if it's not going as well as you want. Reassess the situation. See if you still want to go with this. You know, that there's never any tips and tricks on how to grow a channel or that are 100% legit. This is the best way to grow your channel. Like, there's no guarantees in this business or hobby, whichever it is for you. This is the guy who killed me in I was his class. But that was Kim Strike Fell. Let me know what your guess was in the comments below. Thank you for watching. It's been a flying modem. I'm out here, y'all. Peace.